What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I am showing you everything that I picked up in the past few months for the upcoming spring and summer months. I'm super excited to wear light jeans, sandals, tank tops, all of the good stuff that comes with those seasons. So I'm excited to show you what I picked up. I know you guys really like seeing these videos. I have some stuff from Zara. I have some stuff from Aritzia. I got some stuff from Nordstrom. So all of my favorite places. I'm also including shoes in today's video, which is something that I don't usually do, but I just thought it would be fun to show you what shoes are going to be my kind of staples this coming um, season. So without further ado, let's just get into this video. Oh, one more thing I do want to mention is that as you can tell, my background is different. I'm kind of trying to experiment in the new place where the best lighting is. Um, so for now, you guys just have a lovely shot of my kitchen. Um, but yeah, let's just get into this video okay so I'm gonna start with shoes like I said um, the first pair of shoes I got doesn't necessarily like scream spring per se but I feel like I can make it work and they're also gonna be something that lasts me through I think every single season honestly but they are these combat looking boots from All Saints they are very reminiscent of Doc Martens which I have um, but sometimes I just avoid wearing my Docs because they're super super chunky and I kind of like I wanted a boot that had like a little bit more of a feminine kind of slimmer fit so these are really great they're super cute they just have like a lace up um, design and then they have zippers on the side so I kind of like that the leather also too is almost a little bit patent but not quite um, but these are really cute so I'm really excited to wear these I think they're gonna be cute kind of in the spring and summer months with like little slippy dresses and like a denim jacket or something so I'm really excited to style those so stay tuned if you want to see more of those um, the next pair of shoes that I picked up for the spring and summer months are these Vince sandals. These I saw at Nordstrom and immediately when I saw them I was like I have to have those but obviously they're Vince so I had to think about it for quite some time because you know it is real leather and Vince does have a heavier price tag per se so I really thought about it and I kind of just kept coming back to them and I actually wore a pair of sandals similar to this last season um, from like just the Nordstrom band cast lot I believe and I literally wore them to death so I thought it would be good to just invest in a good pair that I know is really gonna last me and I'm probably gonna wear almost every single day in the coming months so they're just really good casual easy to wear so I really like those and I'm excited to style them the next pair of shoes I'm so, so excited about. You guys know I'm kind of a sucker for white shoes. Um, and I picked these up. These are from Zara. I really love them. They kind of have like the mock croc or maybe it's snake print. I'm not totally sure, but just design on them. They've got a super low block heel, so they'll be good for work. Um, they won't kill your feet. But I just love the kind of little V detail. I just think they're so cute and they're gonna look really good. I've already styled them a few ways on my Instagram. I will insert photos somewhere on here or you can check out my Instagram, which is at style and fashion blog if you don't follow it already. Um, but yeah, I really love these. I think white shoes are an absolute staple for spring, so I am really excited to wear them the next pair of shoes I got are something that I have I don't have anything else in my closet like them they are these free people um, vegan leather clogs and I don't know I think I just woke up one morning and was like I need to get a pair of clogs I don't know exactly why but I just don't have anything like it so I thought it would be really fun I think this is gonna be really good for the lighter warmer months um, but I think these would just look really cute with like white pants a cute blouse and like going out to dinner or something um, But I've only worn them once so far. They're actually very comfortable. They look like this I'll have a picture of them or I'll have them linked below so you can see how the straps wrap around But basically this part it like wraps around your ankle and then has this cute little cross detail in the back so they're really adorable. I love them. They're definitely not in my like day-to-day -day style and they're not something that I usually would go for, but I thought why not give it a try, try something new, change it up. So I can't wait to figure out how to style these more. Um, maybe I'll do a styling video or something. But the last pair of shoes that I got are these Golden Goose sneakers. These are were quite an investment, but 
Golden Goose sneakers have been something that I've been thinking about for like years now and finally when I went to LA it was kind of like my treat yourself gift. Um, I didn't really do a whole lot of shopping that trip so this was kind of like my one big purchase um, and I do not regret it at all. Um, I've literally worn these almost every single day since I got them. They're just so cute. They're so effortless and you know they kind of do look a little bit flashy because I got the ones with the gold sparkly star but they're actually so versatile and they look a lot more neutral when you have them on. Um, and I do wear them untied. I'm not really sure if that's how you're supposed to but I just like how that looks so I've left it that way but I really love these I think these are gonna be really cute in the coming months with just like white jeans a pair of like cut off shorts even like a simple um, easy to wear dress so I'm very excited about these and yeah that's okay, all so that actually concludes the shoe portion of the video um, I'm just gonna move right into tops and coats um, the first one being this chambray shirt I picked this up from Aritzia this is from their denim forum collection it has this kind of nice just like faux pocket I guess it's just like stained um, but I really like it I got it in a size medium because I wanted it to be a little bit more oversized and relaxed I didn't want it to be like super form-fitting um, but I love the fit I think it's gonna look really cute in the spring and summer I feel like it just goes with so many different um, outfits and I also really like that because it is a little bit oversized it can be worn as like a little coat and just kind of like an over shirt so I feel like this is gonna be a really nice piece to have and I'm really excited to style it more the next coat coat I picked up is the Skylar trench coat if you guys watched my last spring Aritzia haul you guys know that I actually picked this up in camel but I love the coat so much and it's super functional in Seattle because it is a raincoat. I decided to pick up the forest green color. I think this is going to be really nice because it's also going to transition into fall since it is a good fall color. So I justified it that way to pick it up. You guys all know what this looks like, but it's just super long. It goes down really nice. It has pockets and it's just a really great lightweight material. Um, you can pop it over a t-shirt like I have now, but it also looks really cute over like a really good hoodie so um this was a must i'm so glad i picked this color up i thought it was sold out for a while so when i saw it back in stock i got right on that train and i'm so glad that i did the next coat i picked up is the rondelle jacket this is also from aritzia um it's this beautiful cream color and it honestly kind of looks like a mix between like a bowling shirt and like a pajama top but I'm obsessed. I actually, when I bought it, I thought it was a shirt, which is originally how I planned on wearing it. Obviously not with this t-shirt underneath, but now I'm excited because I can feel like, I feel like I can wear it both ways. So, you know, as like a little over shirt, similar to the button up chambray shirt, um, but also as a blouse. So I think this is going to be super nice. It's very versatile, um, as I just mentioned, but again, you guys know I love this bone color, so... Yeah, I feel like it's super spring and I'm excited to wear it. The next item I picked up is this beautiful salmon colored blazer. Um, this is from Nordstrom. I believe it's by their Mural brand. If you guys watched my um, trying on all my blazers and cardigans episode, you guys, you guys will know that Mural is one of my favorite blazer brands, like hands down. Um, I always get it at Nordstrom. It's in the BP section, but when I saw this color, it just, I felt like it was calling to me. I just think the color is so beautiful and I have nothing in my wardrobe that is this color, so um, and you guys can even see like look how pretty it looks just like contrasted against like the light tone so I'm very excited about this um, but it just looks like this it has a single button and then it has little pockets here which right now are stitched together I'll get my seam ripper out and um, open those babies up but for now I love the look of it it is a little bit more long line and then it has the opening in the back but I think this is going to be a really great piece. You guys know my whole spiel on blazers. You can wear them fancy. You can wear them casual. So I'm happy to add another one to the collection. This next coat, this is from Topshop. I picked this up from Nordstrom. But it's this really cute little just like cropped denim jacket. 
I really like it. The only denim jacket I have in my closet right now is my TNA one from Aritzia. So I wanted something else to kind of like change it up a little bit. But I love Topshop denim jackets. I think they're just super classic. I think they wear really well and they're a good price point. So I picked this one up. I actually picked it up because I wanted to style it with a piece that I'm going to show you a little later on. I'll let you know when it comes about. But I think this is going to look really cute over a little dress and then also even with those like All Saints combat boots. So I'm very excited about this. I probably won't be wearing it with like t-shirts just because it is so cropped and I kind of don't like how you can see the the difference between the two like so obviously. So I don't know we'll see let me know what you guys think in the comments below but I really like this little piece I think it's cute and I'm excited okay so since purchasing this coat I have already worn it so much I took it to LA with me um, since I've come back I've worn it a ton but this is the Sabrina jacket this is from Aritzia um, and then I love the pockets on it I think this is just really nice for the whole spring utility trend um, so I'm super excited about it I love the bone color as always it does come in like a darker camel color so if you like that tone a little bit more for yourself definitely check it out but I think this is the perfect lightweight jacket for spring it goes with so many pieces over sweaters with a t-shirt over a blouse so you really can't go wrong with this I think it's great and it's the perfect weight for spring so yeah. this is a sweater from Aritzia I got it in a size extra small this is from I think their little moon brand um, but it's really really cute it has just this kind of like crochet detail all the way around and then it has three buttons I got it in extra small because I wanted to wear it as a shirt like I am now um, the smaller was definitely the small was definitely more oversized on me and I think would look great as just a regular cardigan but because I wanted to wear it as a shirt I wanted it to be a little bit more fitted hence why I got the extra small but I really love this I think even though it is transitioning into warmer months, I feel like it's still good to have lighter sweaters on hand just because there's always those chillier nights and especially in Seattle because it doesn't get crazy, crazy hot. So I feel like I can still get away with this even at night. So I really love this piece. I think it's going to do me well. I've already worn it a ton and I really just love the details in it and I think there's nothing more satisfying than like a crisp white sweater or a crisp white t-shirt. So. Yeah. Okay, so this next top is kind of crazy and out there, but I got this at a local boutique. Um, I don't actually know the name of the brand. I'll look in the tag after this little clip has been filmed, and I'll definitely have it below. Um, but it is this cheetah blouse, and one of my favorite YouTubers, Alana Davison, she, I saw her wearing a cheetah blouse, and I felt very obligated to get a cheetah blouse, um, so I did. Um, I didn't want to spend a ton of money, so I just went to a local boutique, and I honestly just stumbled across this and got lucky but I really love it I think it's super fun um, you guys know I'm obsessed with cheetah you know that I'm obsessed with snake print and I feel like this just kind of adds to my collection of favorite animal prints so I really love this one I think the fit is really nice it has like a deeper kind of like little V to it which I like and then the collar starts back here which I think is just like a nice little touch and then the sleeves have this little like extra like panel which I think is really cool so yeah loving the cheetah I think it looks really cute with like white pants like even with these pants and those like black wind sandals I think would be a great outfit um who knows maybe I'll wear that today but yeah love this little blouse okay so this next piece this is from Aritzia um this is also from the brand Little Moon like that white sweater um but when I saw the shirt I honestly just fell in love with the pattern I think the little ruffles are also just super adorable I know it's like borderline grandma-esque especially with like the colors of the shirt but I just think this shirt screams spring and I think it looks really cute with white pants a good pair of denim um and I think it's just a really versatile piece so you know wear it with a pair of 
cute business pants and you're good to go for work but if you want to wear it more casual and like to a nice dinner that's definitely an option too um if you want to go even fancier i know that this does come with like a matching like maxi skirt so if that's something you're interested to check it out but yeah, I love the colors. That's definitely what sold me. And you guys know how I love my Aritzia blouses. I just feel like they're made so well. They're super breathable. And they just last so long. So I'm very excited about adding this one to my closet. And I think it's just going to look really cute for spring and summer. Okay, so this is the Isabel dress from Aritzia. This is the item I was saying I want to wear with that crop top shop denim jacket over top. Um, but it's just this really cute little cheetah slip dress. You guys know I love my cheetah print. Um, as I mentioned before, this dress has pockets, which is really great. But I really want to wear this with those All Saints boots and the crop top shop jacket. So I'm excited for it to be warm enough for me to finally do so. But I just think this is a really great piece. Super effortless and easy to wear. And I'm very excited about it. So... Yeah, just a fun little spring and summer dress. I definitely will not overheat in this by any means. Okay, so this is the next item that I wanted to show you guys. This is my Anin, Anin Bing crew neck sweater. Um, I picked this up in LA and I am so glad that I did. I love my Anin Bing t-shirt, so I thought why not get a crew neck? And I'm so glad I did. I love the glowing cat on it. Uh, I just think it's super edgy and I really like it. It looks great with a pair of jeans, but it also looks looks good with sweats and leggings so what more could you want I've worn it a ton since I got it I've worn it a lot with those golden goose sneakers actually um, just because I think it's a fun contrast and the next item I wanted to show you I did pick up another pair of Levi's wedgie jeans these I got at Nordstrom in their TBD department um, but yeah that's all. You guys know I love my Levi's wedgie jeans, um, and I didn't have a white pair, so I thought it was time to add that to the collection. Oh my gosh, CC is literally going insane right now. Um, but yeah, I did also pick up two more pairs of white pants, and that will conclude the haul. I'm going to show you guys them now. Um, the yeah. next pair of pants I picked up are these. I actually have these in the dark brown color. You guys will probably recognize them. Um, but these are from Aritzia. I don't remember the name. I'll have it linked below. But I've been wearing them with them just cuffed up because I think it looks pretty cute with like whatever shoe you're wearing. Um, they also look great rolled down as well. So keep that in mind. But I don't know guys. I am just all about white pants for spring and I think these Aritzia ones are so fun. I love the big pockets. They do come in like a cargo style and I kind of wish I got those, but I don't want to get them now because I feel like they're so similar. So, eh, we're just going to cut our losses there, but I really love these. They're kind of like a utility like work pant style. So yeah, they're fun. I like them. And now I'm going to show you the last pair of white pants that so I got. This is the last pair of white pants and the last item in this video. This pair is from Madewell. I got them at Nordstrom. Um, but I am loving the exposed fly button. Um, I did get a pair of light wash ones from Aritzia, which I really loved. And so when I saw these with the same kind of style, I felt very inclined to buy them, but I really love how these fit. These are definitely a true skinny jean, um, which you guys know that I'm actually not quite used to wearing. Um, but I really like these, and I think they're cute. Like I said, I'm all about white pants for spring, so these are cute. I did cut them myself because they came cropped, but per usual, they weren't cropped enough for me. So, yeah. That concludes today's video. I hope you guys all enjoy. Let me know what your favorite piece was. Let me know what your favorite pieces for spring are. Um, but I will see you guys all in next week's video. Bye.